Uh, free elite receiver. Let's see who we get. Let's see, let's see, let's see. What's good? Welcome back to On The Sticks, where we provide you with information you need so you can spend more time on the sticks. I'm Sticks, and today we'll be taking a look at the Tom Brady EA Early Access Solos. And I can go ahead and let you guys know that these solos are trash compared to those uh, Pat Mahomes solos. Not like they're harder or anything, but there are more that take longer to complete. I think there's more that have, you have to play the whole game or a whole half or something like that. But yeah, they're trash compared to the Pat Mahomes joints. But you got to complete them if you want the Brady Power collectible piece and if you want the free elite receiver. So if you want to see what receiver I got from completing these challenges, make sure you stay tuned through the end of the video. Also, if you guys want to see me grind these solos out over on twitch.tv slash on the sticks, let me know down below in the comments and let me know if you guys are enjoying the early access of Madden 22 so far, if any of you have jumped in. But yeah, so far these solos, they're pretty simple. Just as the same as the Pat Mahomes joints, just another 10 solos. Uh, comprising of easy stuff like score a touchdown this drive, score a touchdown this play, complete combats, things like that. If anything, it's giving you a chance just to play with Tom Brady a bit. It's a bit different playing with Brady compared to Mahomes. I can tell the difference. You know, you're not trying to get out of the pocket and scramble with Brady as you will with Mahomes. When you're in the pocket with Brady, you just want to launch that thing. As you can see, he just did it right there. Easy touchdown. So it was it was cool playing with Tom Brady because I don't think I've ever played with a uh, Tom Brady. <laughs> on mutt before so it was uh very interesting even though i hated to play with him as a patriot on here because you know i'm a ravens fan so i ain't trying to play no patriot players but it was a bit easier playing with him in the books i like this little little uh throw right here we made top tight end but i like playing with him as the bucks i didn't mind that as much as him in the, the patriots outfit of course they added the solo when you play against the the falcons they can't do tom brady moments without having that super bowl against the falcons but uh, it was a uh, it was cool playing. But I don't think I had any problems with any of the teams really like that. Let's see what the Saints had going on here. The Saints was playing because the Saints was cool. You know, I'm ready to see what they do with Jameis back there instead of Drew Brees. As you can see, we got the easy sack right there on Jameis. Wouldn't be surprised if we see a lot of that this year. <laughs> and right here, we had a a good 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 kickoff right here. Thought it was going to be our first kick return of the year. We we almost had it. We came super close right there. Maybe we'll get one today when we get on there and grind out some more solos. Brady throwing dots. I had a lot of plays to this guy, Noah Gray. My, uh, is he my starting tight end? He's either my starting tight end or my backup tight end, but he made a lot of plays. And, uh, I was very surprised, but I can't wait to get a better tight end. Most likely gonna use my level 10 Ricky Premier for a tight end, most likely, unless I get somebody else. Brady again throwing some dots. We should have scored right there, really. We should have, that should have been a touchdown. But yeah, I'm most likely gonna use that level 10 free rookie premiere on a tight end. That breaking tackles, making plays, making plays. So my Joe Mixon, he's doing pretty good. He's playing pretty good. And got him as a free player too, out of a pack. So I'm happy with making that choice. Like I said, it came down between Joe and who was it? I can't remember who else, but we went with Joe. And Willie Sneed been playing pretty good too. I'm glad with that pick. Willie Sneed, shout out to him. That was a, a solid pick. Mm. Look at him, coming up big right there. That's what I'm talking about, Willie. That's what I'm talking about. But yeah, I'm glad with that pick. Willie and Sterling, Sterling Shepard, they're doing pretty good as my one and two receivers. But can't wait to get a new receiver, a, a true number one receiver. And as you can see, they almost returned the kickoff there. I got nervous when he brought that first tap and there was nobody else out there. He should have he should have scored. I don't know what what messed him up right there. I guess because uh, the difficulty is so low when you're doing this solo. Or any other difficulty they would have scored right there. That should have been a touchdown too. Luckily enough, he fell down <laughs> and didn't score. That should have been another one. But so far, enjoying Mutt. You know, it's early EA access period. Ten hour trial. Really enjoying it. Mm. And we needed that because I think on that that uh, solo challenge, if they scored any points, we would have lost. So that was a big, big come up for our defense right there. Brady throwing that thing again. I got another one. Cause that Sterling Shepard that time. Like I said, both of them's playing pretty good, but we do end up getting our true number one receiver at the end of these solos from completing both sets. Like I said, you need to complete all 20 of them to get your free elite receiver. Let me know what receiver you guys get down below in the comments if you completed all these solos. 
I mean, Brady's just throwing dots. Ain't nothing more to say. I'm glad we broke that tackle there to get that touchdown because I'd have been upset if we didn't break it and get it. Brady, once again, the, uh, the little quick passes to the receivers have been working pretty good so far. But like I said, it might be because the solo challenges are uh, low difficulty level at the start. And later on in the season, they probably won't work as good because you're going to go up against better corners and DBs that's going to lock down them joints. <laughs> But right now they're they're working pretty good. There we go. Big hit needed that. I mean, that. I feel like uh I see less fumbles. Well, at least right now. But that could just be because uh my players aren't as good yet. So we got our fantasy pack for Brady and Mahomes. And you pick which one you want. The power up versions of. It was no doubt in my mind I was going to take Pat just because I prefer having a mobile quarterback but it would have been nice to have Tom as you can see I do have Kyler that I got in the last video from a pack so but I always knew I was going with Pat like I said gotta have that mobile QB for those uh those solos and here we go our uh, free elite receiver let's see what we get let's see let's see let's see we got Chris Godwin <laughs> and uh, I feel like that's a pretty solid receiver to get right there I was pretty happy with that I was super cool with that. So let me know down below in the comments who you guys ended up getting. Like I said, I'm cool with that 82 overall elite receiver. It could be, I'm trying to think, I guess you can get any elite receiver through that joint. 80 overall or up, so you can get some crazy picks. As you can see, we got our Tom Brady collectible. Give us that exclusive artwork right there if we want to go through our Tom Brady elite power up. So yeah, those were the Tom Brady EA Access Early Trial Solos. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, be sure to check back here for more content on the sticks daily. And once again, let me know down below in the comments if you guys want to see me grind out these solos over on Twitch. I'm currently working on those campaign solos. We might knock them out all week. All, well, I don't know if we get them all knocked out over the weekend, but we're going to play as many as we can until our free trial run out or until we don't have time to work on them anymore. But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the video and I'll catch you next one. Peace out.